Hello? You? Oh, hello. I am offering this disclaimer to remind you this video series is not meant for children. Hello everyone, good morning, good evening, whatever you may be. My name is Endo, and welcome back to Elite Dangerous. Today I am operating out of the Bernard Star system, because uh, Kotenari has more or less stabilized now. I have picked up a couple of uh, delivery missions. One for uh, 120 tons of superconductors to the good station Filgul Sang port, and then another set of uh, two tons of explosives. I'm not questioning what they need that for in the LHS 449 system to a, a one Perry station. I wonder if I'm sell delivering that to Dufin Smurfs and Evil Incorporated. And then I need to uh, collect uh, 81 tons of uh, performance enhancers, which is basically recaf and uh, other energy drinks, basically, for all intents and purposes. And with that out of the way, uh, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell for notifications. I'm sorry, I'm uh, front-loading this now. Smarter minds than I do not know what this does. All I know is that it... Uh, Enjoins you to my eternal crusade against YouTube and its sorting algorithms, and so uh, that is that. I am also feeling a little bit under the weather. I will uh, try to keep uh, things on track as much as I can, but I cannot promise anything on this one because I have a, uh, a splitting headache. Uh, it uh, feels like uh, there is extreme pressure behind one of my uh, eyeballs in the sinuses, so I may have a, an extreme head cold. At least that's what I believe. Hopefully I can just sleep it off and be uh, very chipper tomorrow for the Hutton event that we are going to be holding. Well, tomorrow for me, Saturday for you, and all that other good stuff, and I'll have the video up on Sunday. Coincidentally, that is my birthday. That, that, that's about it. I'm not asking for anything. I'm not uh, expecting anything. Uh, where was I? Mm, yes, just about to hit Furugulseng port. And deliver these... Uh, 120 tons of superconductors. There was an update to that mission at the. Oh, hello. Dana Mitu. Oh, and uh, worth half a million credits. That's gonna be fun. That is. I don't think I want to actually mess with that one. Also, I am in a. a bit of the doghouse because I accidentally let my uh, one of my missions expire yesterday regarding hunting down a certain pirate uh, that bail jumper so unfortunately he escapes for a day or four hard to say I might pick him up uh, as another mission later on in the future who's to say certainly not Definitely feeling like a hit. Hello. Hello. Uh, there was a pirate chasing after me, and I didn't notice it. It seems. Why is my ship acting all sluggish today? Or is it just my mind? Hard to say. I mean, I landed. Pretty much perfectly, right there. There are your superconductors, good sir. I will take uh, all this influence and half the credits. 
I'll certainly take that because I'm not hurting for credits. Let's go around. Let's get these explosives delivered. I don't have any nav data there, so uh, there's that. And I've already figured out where to get these uh, the performance enhancers as well. It is uh, my good favorite station, Magnus Gateway. Bunch of freaking nerds. In the easy Aquaria system. So, there's that. I've got everything planned out and ready to go for us. Just need to get out of there. Out of uh, the mass lot of the station and get going. I was going to have a video, an extra video for tomorrow, but uh, this head cold has just put me completely and totally off my game. So the new series will actually be starting next Saturday. Yes, that's right, a new series. Because recently, a uh, copy of Sekiro Shadows Die Twice has come into my possession. So I believe I will be doing a video series on that. I am thinking of calling it Sekiro Saturdays. Oh no. Yep. Mr. Stephen Young, okay. It's. T He's in a python? He's dangerous? I ain't touching that. I ain't not touching that. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 I ain't doing that. Uh-uh. I ain't fighting that. I don't even want to be half interdicted by that. I just want to get to the station and get this delivered. Uh-uh. 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 I thought by the credit amount that uh, that would be easier, but no. I'm in no condition to be fighting in com that kind of combat right now. not in any mental condition for that. Yes, made it into range. Inside the no fire zone, that's good. And hopefully what's gonna happen is he's gonna ping pong off the side of the freaking station. And then I don't have to worry about him. That's my hope, anyway. Well. There's the crash landing. I had a coolant purge instead of the... Okay. Well, not so much as crash landing as just skimming across the surface of the landing pad. But yeah, uh-uh. Nope, don't want that. No. Not dealing with any dangerous customers today. And oh, I thought this was a higher influence position. Mission. Position. Mission. Position. Not a position. I already have my job. What am I thinking? And now, uh, easy aquaria. Easy aquaria. Yes. 
So I've alluded to it a few times, but I have come up with a an idea, per se, on what to do with some of these modules being used by power play. Allow me to present my idea. I call it the reverse engineer. So what you do is uh, you unlock your uh, power play module. And so long as you are in the faction and have the power play module, you can go to this uh, reverse engineer. And there is an internal server side counter for how many times you sell that particular module to your uh, reverse engineer man. And then once you hit sort of a critical mass, you can then bring in uh, extra spare parts, like engineering, so to say, and gain access to different sizes, different sizes of the engineering modules. Because I would love to ha run class three pack hounds up top. And then I could have Class 2 Advanced Plasma Accelerators on the bottom. That would be fun, in my opinion. But that's just like my opinion there. Now, it doesn't necessarily work ex that well when you consider other uh, modules, like the. My man just blinked out. The Prismatic Shields. Because those are available in all sizes, all ship sizes. I mean, all uh, module sizes, if I remember correctly. Which, when you throw those on a, when you throw a maximum size prismatic set of shields on an imperial cutter, it just has an, a, a, a gargantuan amount of shielding. Like, it's absurd, honestly. Very absurd. But, yeah. Take your, take your standard mo- take your- Take your power play modules, sell them off at a uh, particular place, similar to uh, how some engineers have unlock requirements for, uh, you have to take uh, meta alloys to a specific one, or uh, have to have jumped like 5,000 light years away from the- the system. I have that one unlocked on this character, but I do not have that unlocked on end up yet. Like you have to jump five thousand light years from the core, if I remember correctly. If I remember correctly, and that is a big if, because in my current mental state, that is uh, memory is not exactly the best. Although I did, ex I did remember where I could get uh, the. Performance enhancers offhand because I know that Magnus Gateway is a bunch of freaking nerds living there and they need recaf and caffeine pills and all the good stuff in order to dig through all their books and whatnot. And why am I calling Magnus a giant freaking nerd? No reason. And uh, he did no wrong. Absolutely not. That was all his brother's fault. I almost called his brother Petrabo, but no, it's not Petrabo. Uh, and not Horus either, for that matter. It was. Everything is Lorgar's, Lorgar's fault. Lorgar Aurelius. Magnus just got, uh... Just kind of got just as planned by that bastard Zeech. But, yes, I'm going to get these performance enhancers, get those delivered back to Bernard Star, and then rack out for the night. 
take a NyQuil and go the F to sleep, is what I'm thinking. I don't think I have any NyQuil Extreme anymore, and that always gives me weird dreams anyway. So, there's that. I'm already half daydreaming about bed. I think I'm lined up with that. Yes, I am. Why'd I go sliding like that? I know I had my landing gear deployed. I know my ship had come to a complete stop. More or less. And where is my performance enhancer? It's under medicines, right? Yes, it is. Like I said, recap. At least that's my uh, opinion anyway. Can't get any tobacco here, so I can't just, I can't bring low sticks with me. And now, Barnard's start. How are we looking at on time? Not too long, not too short. Yeah, I really did not want to deal with that dangerous pirate, by the way. Just not have the mental fortitude for that today at all. Probably a little bit dehydrated as well. Which I don't know why that is. Definitely dreaming of bed. I just uh, preemptively deployed my landing gear. I'm not even in the correct system. my route to the station or just the star? More questions than answers tonight. Yeah, my house actually feels cold, so I must have a must have a mild fever. That's fun. That's n that, that that I take I, I take that back. That's not fun. I don't want to I don't want to mess with that either. I figured it was going to be bad with a half a million bonus. For no. Oh Jesus Christ! Really? Who are who is this guy? Ganami too. Okay. Who was the first pirate then? That's not even That's not even the pirate I thought I was looking at. That's just that's just peachy. Okay, where the Duh. That just brings up more questions. Any more? Maybe, maybe not. Watch, I get interdicted by that Type 7. Just like that wedding barter that one time. And why do they call it a wedding barge? You'd think it'd be a wedding liner. That's just my opinion, though. I, I, I guess if it was on, like, a Type 10 or a Type 7 or a Type 9. 
not a Type 10. Type 10 are combat ships. I keep on forgetting that. Which is basically just a refitted Type 9. Hello? You- oh, hello! <laughs> you caught up startlingly quickly. And goodbye, man. Freaking missiles and everything. I am so glad there's a no fire zone right here. And that the NPCs follow that law. Even though they're already pirates, so I don't know why, but whatever. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell for notifications. And to join me in my eternal crusade against YouTube and its sorting algorithms. I hope you enjoyed my name prattling, and hopefully I will see you all in the next video, which should be a good one because it's a hut in the activity. We're going to be racing, si not sidewinders, racing scarabs, SRVs, across the back of a, you know what, for all that trouble I'm just going to take the 5 million credits on that one, just because. We will be racing SRVs across the ridge line, which that should be a hoot. And hopefully I will be uh, capable of actually taking part in that. Mentally, right? Yeah. Anyway, hopefully I will see you all in the next video.